Loom hires private contractors to guard their CTOS centers. These guys will be geared up and wired for action. But I'll be ready. My bad. doubles their guards, I better double my weapons. Welcome. Anything I can help you with? Over the past few weeks, CTOS centers throughout Chicago have increased security due to several attacks from activist hacker group DeadSec. When asked about security changes, Bloom spokeswoman Charlotte Gardner was decisive. Chicago's safety is paramount, so we've hired private security for every CTOS control center. These highly skilled peacekeepers have trained in the most dangerous regions of the world. In fact, Ms. Gardner, these peacekeepers you refer to are military mercenaries, many with criminal records. Isn't that true? Indeed, they've served time in the military, but 
We should hardly reject our brave soldiers for proudly serving their country, should we? Our CTOS network is well protected. And that gives Chicago citizens the comfort they deserve. That was Bloom spokeswoman Charlotte Gardner discussing CTOS security. Take care now. New security is no joke. I need access. How to find out who's targeting my family. I want that voice behind the phone call.
You're not supposed to. Was that? That's it. That's it. I'm hacked in. What? You mean you're in the CTOS already? I'm looking at the network as we speak. You got your access, and I've got mine. Profiler systems online. Everybody's nasty little secrets at the click of a button. This thing's highlighting all kinds of stuff in the district. I can take advantage of some of this. Keep an eye out for online traffic. Could be fixers in the network. If I can see them, they can see me. All right, I gotta move. I mean, a lot of noise here. Give me time to track your caller. I'll be in touch. Inside someone's home. I need you to cover something for me. What is it? I lined up a lucrative deal with a very demanding client. He needs a driver. No. But here's the thing. I come in this morning, find Maurice trying to dig his way out of the guest room. So I need to move him. Now I could pass this problem on to you since Maurice is really your problem. But that's not my style. 
I always finish what I start, and all I'm asking of you... All right, fine. I'll handle it. Well, no, don't let me put you out. I said I'd handle it. It's a job. Exactly. It's a delivery job. Gotta move some guy. I mean, how hard is that? Just keep in mind my reputation's on the line here. He's paying top dollar for the best driver in Chicago. Then he's in luck. He's trying to hack in. Maybe if I trace his signal back, I'll find him before he breaches my phone. search area. Come on, Aiden. Find him quick. Almost in. There you are. You're mine now. Got him. That's one fixer down. Now, how many more are out there? Someone's taken an interest in me. Fixers are mercenaries, they work for a paycheck. Someone's issued a contract on me. That's bad fucking news. If I remember right, 
These guys communicate through the grid. In fact, no time like the present. Let's see what kind of contract I can pick up. One of our high value targets is in town. We need you to hack them and install a back door for us. Jordy's job, some kind of driving contract, delivering a guy somewhere. This won't be a typical taxi service. The trick with these jobs is avoiding the cops.
nighttime invasion on a manufacturing plant. One assailant died at the scene, while one remains at large. Expect delays within Parker Square as police have set up roadblocks. This is squad. We've got a green light on CTOS search. Scanning for suspect now. driver. Fuck, man, what took you so long? You got a car this in the shop right now. 
No. My rules, your car. That's the job. All right, well, come on, man. Let's go. What the shit? Eddie's dead. I left him back there. Oh man, the cops came out of nowhere. This is bad. Just follow the route and keep an eye on. Him. What the shit? Eddie's dead. I left him back there. Oh man, the cops came out of nowhere. This is bad. Just follow the route and keep an eye on. Cops are still searching. Your route's gonna get us killed. Sit back and keep quiet. Just stick to the plan. I know what I'm doing. Is that how your buddy wanted it? Damn, it's a patrol car. I see it. What the shit? Eddie's dead. I left him back there. Oh man, the cops came out of nowhere. This is bad. Just follow the route and keep an eye on. The cops are still searching. Your route's gonna get us killed. Sit back and keep quiet. Just stick to the plan. I know what I'm doing. That how your buddy wanted him dead? Keep your head down. Uh, squad, we're gonna work the alleys and see if we can flush them out. Copy that. All surrounding bridges are still up except the wells. Got support inbound on the well. So come on, what's the plan? Talk to me. You need to calm down. They got the island locked up. We'll stick to the back alleys, garages, keep out of sight. If you see me kill the engine and cut the lights, you keep quiet. Just be an old parked car. Understand? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Shit. My hands won't stop shaking. You ever seen a guy shot in the guts before? Too many. Oh, man, talk to me. I'm freaking out here. Hey, maybe, maybe Eddie's alive. He, he, he took one to the belly. I heard that's the best place to get shot. Is that true? A wound like that can go either way. If the bullet doesn't go right through, you're looking at a lot more collateral damage. Listen, the cops are gonna want answers, which means your friend will get an escort to the hospital. You said you've seen a lot of gut shots. How many of them lived? Lived? Let's concentrate on getting you out, okay? Jesus, man. Jesus, I killed Eddie. I know I did. I heard the sirens and I just reacted. I, I thought I'd slow him down if I wounded him. I was aiming for his arm, man. I swear to God. One of us had to make it back, right? These people don't do this. They're a failure. Everything went to shit. Eddie's dead. I left him back there. Oh, man. The cops came out of nowhere. This is bad. Just follow the route and keep an eye on. The cops are still searching. Your route's gonna get us killed. Sit back and keep quiet. Just stick to the plan. I know what I'm doing. That how your buddy wanted him dead? Keep your head down. Uh, squad, we're gonna work the alleys and see if we can flush them out. Copy that. All surrounding bridges are still up except the wells. You've got support inbound on the wells. Plan. Talk to me. You need to calm down. You got the island locked up. We'll stick to the back alleys, garages, keep out of sight. If you see me kill the engine and cut the lights, you keep quiet. Just be an old parked car. Understand? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Shit. My hands won't stop shaking. You ever seen a guy shot in a. Oh, fuck, man. They said you were good. You did it. Some 
guys, just don't fuck it up now. That's Lucky Quinn. Why is the club boss meeting us? He's not meeting us. He's meeting you. Someone knew. I swear, I don't know what happened. There wasn't supposed to be anybody. I, I mean, it's a computer plant, right? I turn around, the alarm's going off. The cops got there so fast. <laughs> Quiet now. It's all over, son. I got it, Elise, right? That's what matters. It is indeed what matters most. This is how the world turns. Not much room for fuck ups. Oh, oh, I get that, Mr. Quinn. I do. It wasn't my fuck up, dog. Yeah. It wasn't. Yeah, well, calm now. It's all right. Calm? Get a chance to talk to your mama? Call your friends? Your girl? No, sir. I was in a hurry. That's good. Very good. Tell your employer I'll call again. If ever I need a, another delivery. Lucky fucking Quinn. He runs the Chicago South Club. These assholes have been preying on Chicago since before I was born. I could have done the city a huge favor if I put one between his eyes. But this is exactly what I've been trying to stay away from. It always comes back hard. That can't happen again. Hey, how'd it go? You finished that job yet? You thought I'd be okay working for the fucking club? A paycheck is a paycheck. You gotta start separating the morals from the moolah. Relax. Listen, I can hook you up with my guy. He'll find you better driving gigs if you want. Yeah, sure. I don't know if I'll take them. Give him my name. Who says no to extra cash, right? Oh, and since you asked, Maurice is doing just fine in his new home. 